Welcome back it. to... Oh, I was hoping Welcome. you'd stare at the uh, machinery going to the other machinery. This Welcome. is my kind of porn. Welcome back to non-player cult. We're looking at some... What's uh, up, like, cultists? What? It's got like a face when it comes Dude. down. Watch, watch, hold on. Wait, where? When it comes down, just look at it. Its mouth forms right here. There. It's got, oh, like, it's got, I see. It's got like buck teeth. <laughs> wow, you faggot, John. <laughs> well, of course you see that, you loser. What? <laughs> I'm a loser because I see faces and objects where there all are all no around me. All familiar faces. I'm a loser. Racist Fuck my aliens. asshole. Or hell beings. <laughs> Xenophobic. My dad Xenophobic. clogged my pit while I played Doom once. My mom rushed and was like, What the fuck are you doing to John? And she joined <laughs> <him>. <laughs> <laughs> She, she's like, what the fuck are you doing? But then immediately puts the strap on on without waiting for the answer. You didn't invite me. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it just seems like it's easier to just run up and beat the shit out of them. Well, yeah, well, yeah it's, it's, it's melee, literally like it's, kill. it's literally shotgun them. It's literally RT and then the, and then the right tri and then the right stick. And the right dick. Yep. Get him, get him, get See, it's turn as soon as they turn like blue, flashy, or whatever. Then you can come up and finish them. Warframe! That was oh, what it was called. That game. I played a little bit of that game. It was alright. That sounds familiar. Yeah, it's a, it's it a, like an MMO shooter. It's actually kind of cool. Yeah, it's really quick paced though. How, how recently did it come out? It was Very like... Very Probably the last three years tops. Oh, yeah, okay. it was like... I want to say it was 2012. I, I want to say it was I'm 2012. I'm pretty sure I've seen it like on Steam. Yeah, Warframe was got me really hyped. I remember it was like... It's on Xbox One. It's pretty dope. Is it's it? free. Oh, yeah, it's right. Free. Yes, it came out right at the beginning of uh, Xbox One's life. I remember, or like right before, because as soon as Xbox One came out, Warframe was on it. I remember that. I I only played it like twice though. Like Warframe I didn't get was more too far into it. This or like... uh, I wouldn't say it's. I, unless I'm not thinking of Warframe, but I remember it being super quick pace. Hmm. What is charge burst? Oh, you get to upgrade the gun? Or are you buying... Explosive Ooh. slot. Oh, okay. Get an explosive. oh okay. And then you beat the shit out of them for giving you a gun? It's just like, <laughs> you fuck, you don't give me weapons. I bet. Codex entry. Is that another book in the space bible? It's just sad now that you beat it. Yeah, you, you punched the confidence out of like, it. It's sad, it's like... What were they? Oh, they were eating humans. Oh, you hold down LT and then, uh... So where are you right now? Are you in I'm, space I'm now? on Mars. Oh, okay. Ooh. That's where the story always takes place, is Mars. Really? Even the original? Yeah. Huh. Oh, no, the original, it's like on some, uh... It's called, like, Tay Tang or something like that. Tay Tang. It's on, it's Tang -tang. on Pootie Tang. It's it takes place on Pootie Tang. Tang. It takes place on Pootie Tang. Tippy tow tippy tay, you gonna get a tip today. Yeah. Aha, uh -huh, you gonna get some dick today. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Oh man, you're just getting fucked up. You're low health. Damn, you're getting fucked up. I gotta mm. say, even the HUD makes it look like Halo, which is really weird because it's made by Bethesda. Oh, sh oh shit, you're... you... you okay. You oh, that, I thought I was powering up or something. I was like... <laughs> you were like, whoa, like, I've gone Super Saiyan. <laughs> you're just like, oh, uh, <laughs> defeating a Saiyan only makes it stronger. <laughs> Your character goes mad autistic and just starts yelling. <laughs> defeating a sandwich only makes it tastier. Defeating a sandwich only makes it tastier. Ugh. <laughs> oh, God. That took a long time to load. Yep. Didn't that a long did. time to chode. Didn't add it then. Big chub. Haha, <laughs> low I'm times. I'm on the wrong way. Haha, <laughs> PS1. I saw this video that explained that, uh, technically there uh, will always be loading. Yeah, no There's shit. no way to, to get rid of it. Although, he theorizes that loading will just take place in the background. So yeah. it won't affect gameplay at all, but there will well, be Well, it'll be like there. rendering as you go. Exactly. Kind of like what they did that in Halo Three. Like, there's very little loading time in between because it would load during cutscenes, which they... was actually pretty smart for a game that was like really old. I was trying to old think. By Didn't... nowadays, wasn't yeah. Spyro the first game to do that? Spyro? Yeah, I want to say it was the first game to do that. I wouldn't I... be surprised because Spyro was like a masterpiece of Dragon Warfare. I don't know. I didn't like Spyro very much. <laughs> I love Spyro just because like. Um... 
Uh, we, you know YMCA? Yeah. You know how they would have that game room where all mm-hmm. the teens go? Yeah, all the, the hip and uh, happenings. I remember I used to go to the tiny little kid play place for a long time, but then I finally turned you old finally enough leveled to, up. I leveled up to be a little teenager, and I was like, oh my gosh, I get to go to the little play place. And I went there, and all I would okay. do is play Spyro. <laughs> and you, you went there, you, all you do is play Spyro, and then your it dad did, would come in and then <laughs> finger so you. He would block your pit. And then all the kids would be like, oh, J- John, are you are you okay? And then they would join in. <laughs> it's like, I feel so bad for him, but I can't miss out on a chance for booty. But, can't uh, miss out on that little boy butt. I mean, it, de- it would depend who was there. Yeah, you know, John was um, the Shota boy of uh, the YMCA. I was a little Shota. He was a cute little Shota boy. <laughs> now, cute is a, cute's a stretch, but, you know, he was the only Shota there, I so was I guess. Pro- I was probably a cute Shota. Not gonna lie. Oh, okay. You well, ain't I mean, cute. Me. You gorgeous I'm... baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright, so cut all that part out. Uh, you know you liked it. I want to start over. <laughs> Welcome back to MPC, guys. Uh, we weren't talking well, beforehand. It, would, it, would depend, it depends who was there, because I had a friend that would play pool with me. But, um... Well, how can we still suck at pool, John? Well, because we only played pool like five times. We played pool every time we went to and recorded at James's house. That was like the first no, six mean, months. Me and my friend. Oh, we oh. We played pool like all the time. <laughs> Why? Wait, did you have a billiards table at the Y? Or? Yeah. Oh, okay. We play uh, pool or play Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh yeah. See, but that at was, the time, uh, at the time, uh, we didn't Yu-Gi-Oh. know how to play Yu-Gi-Oh, so we would just basically pretend. Like you ever do that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I did that with Pokemon cards. <laughs> Shit, I never knew how to play Pokemon cards. <laughs> I only yeah. learned like later on when the Game Boy game came out. I never learned how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. I mean, until actually kind of recently, maybe oh, a couple yeah, of years ago. Didn't I teach you, or did you know before that? Pretty, I knew slightly. I learned around. What? what? They can he do finishing moves on you. Ah, oh, dude, he's he is, his hand wasn't what, even in you. I can still did? see the. What? What are you? What, the, the animation is off. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say he's grabbing right in front of my eyes and then pulling my arm off. <laughs> Yeah, I think your arm was supposed to be there. He wasn't actually pulling the air. You know what? That's okay. That's it's all okay. right. We forgive you, Bethesda. We we'll forgive the game. You uh, you made a Fallout game once. Oh yeah. Or twice. Fallout five. Or no, no, just Fallout three. Fallout New Vegas was made by Two K. Zenimax. What about four? No, no, wait. Ooh. Two. Wait, no, 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 what not Two K. What about four? Four was not made by Bethesda. Are you sure? Yeah. Four was made by. Uh, let me look it up. I, if I remember correctly, they only did Fallout Tactics and Fallout Three. Hold on. Uh, I don't even think they did Tactics. I thought they no, bought no, it no. after it left its. Uh, well, the first two definitely wasn't them. <clears throat> Hold on, I'm trying to remember. Oh, what's funny is like the original creators of the Fallout series went ahead and made like uh, a sequel to their game Wasteland, but like I'm pretty sure no one cared. Because it was, it was hearkening back to the old days of like. Uh, because it wasn't Fallout essentially. Yeah, yeah, it well it was overhead. It was Fallout, basically, but it was overhead and it was uh like. Um, oh shit! Kind of, not text based, but uh. Text heavy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Fallout New, uh, New Vegas was made by Obsidian. Mm-hmm. Let's see. That was honestly Black the Fallout Isle Studios game. did Fallout Two. Uh, what was the Brotherhood of Steel? Brotherhood of Steel was by... Expansion for, uh... That was by Interplay. Interplay. Yep. That was mm. by Interpol. Get the fuck that was down by from... Intercourse. Oh, get the fuck and down I from there. I think Fallout 4 was actually Bethesda. Hold on, let me check. I mean, it was on their website, so it wouldn't make sense. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was Bethesda. I mean, Bethesda... Even the... That one guy, the head of Bethesda, that... Guy with the goofy hair. Yeah, it was what? Bethesda. What the fuck is that? I look. Oh, it's me. It's a pop figure. Get that shit out of here. <laughs> we don't do that shit. Imp, what did you just called, open up a dude, loot crate in the game? Look what it says: Imp model, classic guy. <laughs> it's it's a, it's an extra one, man. This is called Imp model, classic guy. <laughs> oh, in every man. map. So oh, I man. I looked down for a second and you opened up a loot crate. That armor, his armor looks really fucking dope. I think I'm, I probably, I probably like sci-fi stuff more than I'm into fantasy. 
Hmm. I'm pretty sure you're the same. You're a nerd, James. Is I am. So I am you a nerd. probably like. I think you enjoy sci-fi fantasy? more than. Uh, or More than what? Then a uh, sci-fi over fantasy. Which one? Which? What about um, you, John? Fantasy. I. Yeah. Huh. It depends. Cause uh, you strike me as like a classic nerd, James. So I, I figured you'd be more sci-fi. Well, to, it depends. Fantasy, like, I, for instance, I prefer Elder Scrolls to Fallout. Really? Yeah. I, I don't know why. I just like. I do. I think they're. I honestly think that. They're just better games, to be honest. Yeah, maybe that's They're it. a lot bigger, and there's a lot more... I think there's a lot more things to I do. I mean, I like both, but, yeah. like, uh, let's see. I've definitely spent more time with Elder Scrolls games than I did but with like, Fallout. But, like, literally everything else, I'm sci-fi, I believe. Mm -hmm. I, I Because, like, I, I mean, I'm recently getting into Star Trek. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't fall... I, like, I would rather watch... Star Trek or Lord of the Rings or uh, Star Trek or well, Star you, Wars you to get Lord into of the stuff Rings. Really late, like you didn't get into Star Wars at all. Ever. Yeah, exactly. Uh, until like ever. <laughs> yeah, I, I I literally only watched the last movie that came out I've, and like I don't because know. Because my parents like Star Trek. I like Star Trek since I was really, like, really young. Well, I yeah, and I I like Star Trek because like I'm now getting into it and I it's actually me, pretty cool. To me, it's like the novelty of it that's so enjoyable. Um, I don't think the show itself is, like, profound in any way. Well, of course not. It's like an old, campy... It's yeah, really... Yeah, it's, it's really old like and campy. Like, sci-fi. The novelty of it, I just really like. I like, like... I like the... The story and just kind of, like, all the de attention to detail, I Some guess. Some of it's, like, laughable, too. Like, oh, well, yeah, yeah, definitely. The, the trouble with Tribbles is, like, I thought it was one of the, <laughs> the dumbest plot lines for any, like script I've ever read. That one's like the But most it's so like fucking first. hilarious. I mean, they had a literal whole episode called Data's Day. What is where that? It's about him dancing. Really? Him learning to It's because Data was a character who wanted to be human, but he's like a robot. Yeah. But like there's a whole episode where he's learning to dance Sweet. and trying to understand why his friends are having like emotional times when they're about to be married. I don't know. I just remember that his his friend looks uh, kind of like John C. Riley, but attractive. <laughs> hey, you're saying John C. Riley ain't attractive? Uh, I'm saying John A. Meyer ain't attractive. <laughs> <laughs> Roster. Uh, I should say more attractive John C. Riley. Because I, Wait, I, Data I, looks like attractive John no, C. Riley. No, 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 no. His friend did. His friend who was getting married. I don't remember his name. Oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. thought I was stuck. I was like, Bethesda oh, strikes again. <laughs> Where's uh. the last dude? Am I supposed to? No. What? What do you... There's one more dude? Is there a dude count somewhere? Oh, okay. There's, there's two more this there. This does look a little bit like Fallout 4 in the way that it's kind of cartoony. Well... Like, this... The graphics in this don't strike me as realistic. I mean, they're sleek and cool. It's very, it's very, they're very smooth textures. Well, like the thing, the only things I can compare it to is Warframe and Halo, where they have that. It's kind well, of with Fallout Four. They smoothed everything out, and it's very yeah, uh, that's true. Oh, I love the mod that, that adds away. cell shading to uh, Fallout Four because it actually makes it look really nice. Dude, that would be really cool, actually. There's well, no, there is a mod like it's it just adds cell sh cell shading. Oh God. Well, with Bethesda, I love like, like the cell shaded it. look because it's like it's really like comic comicy and cartoony. But I did I honestly didn't enjoy Borderlands that much. Borderlands? I really didn't. Like well, it's Borderlands it's fun, but I think those... it's I think it's overrated. I think it's overrated. It it's is a good overrated. game, but it's really overrated. Oh no, it's completely overrated. Like if you play to me and my friends, it was really fun to play together. But oh yeah, like, I love playing it with one. With but my like, friends. it got so old and boring. Mm -hmm. Borderlands Two just felt like Borderlands One. I can't imagine still playing through the series. Like, if there was no loading, if there was like no loading times, then it w I would have probably enjoyed it a lot more. I didn't like that there was like loading times, and I thought the humor, like everybody was like, "Oh, it's so funny," but you know that one mission where you're like finding a different name for the bully mongs, and he's like, "Oh, I don't know, Bonafoss," and it's like that. Like, I, just, did, just I didn't think was too, fucking, that was fucking funny at all, actually. That was actually. two, like, retarded words. Like, they were, together they were like, 
trying too hard, pretty much, I think. I just watched that texture yeah. load. Though. Yeah. <laughs> well, next time on Non-Player Cult, we're going to watch more textures load. And go to hell. <laughs>